Field of Fire is the 163rd episode of the television series Star Trek – Deep Space Nine, the 13th episode of the seventh season. The episode first aired February 10, 1999, and was written by Robert Hewitt Wolfe and directed by Tony Dow. Topic. Plot After a night of heavy drinking, Esri Dax accompanies Ilario, a fellow DS9 crew member, back to his quarters. The next morning Ilario is found dead there. Julian Bashir determines that Ilario was killed by a tritanium bullet fired at close range. The weapon is determined to be a TR-116, a prototype designed by Starfleet for use in environments where a phaser would be ineffective. But Odo is puzzled, because that kind of weapon usually leaves powder marks on the victim when fired at close range. Yoron Dax, the most violent of the former Dax hosts, surfaces from Esri's subconscious. Yoron tells Esri he can help her find Ilario's killer. Esri summons him to the foreground of her consciousness with a trill ritual. Demonstrating on a melon, Miles O'Brien shows Odo and Dax how the killer gave the bullet a close-range trajectory without being in the same room as the victim. A micro-sized transporter had been fitted to the weapon, enabling it to pass through walls or any other obstacle. The bodies of a 37-year-old female human, and later a male Bolian, both turn up dead with tritanium bullet wounds. The only pattern appears to be that the killer is targeting Starfleet officers, until Esri notices that each of three murder victims had photographs in their quarters that show people laughing. Yoron and Esri deduce that they are dealing with a killer who strikes at laughter, and a Vulcan would be most likely. With Yoron's help, Esri narrows the list of suspects down to 48 Vulcans. Riding in a turbolift with Chulik, one of the suspects, Yoron becomes convinced Chulik is the killer. Chulik realizes Esri suspects him and targets her with his TR-116. Esri uses a TR-116 to shoot Chulik at the same time Chulik shoots at her. The bullet for Esri misses by a narrow margin, but the bullet for Chulik hits its target. Chulik is revealed to have been a crew member on the Starfleet vessel USS Grissom, which experienced severe casualties during the Dominion War. Chulik was one of the ship's few surviving crew members, and the emotional shock of the experience drove him to target any Starfleet officer showing happiness. While being questioned, Chulik attempts to justify his actions by saying, "'Because logic demanded it,' as Yoron demands that Esri finish him off, she instead calls a medical team. Later, Yoron quietly returns to Esri's subconscious with the counter ritual. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> External links. Field of Fire on IMDb. Field of Fire at tv.com. Field of Fire at Memory Alpha, a Star Trek wiki. Field of Fire at Star Trek. Com.